Hey, New Horizon Disciple Makers, Pastor Mark coming to you on a beautiful afternoon. Hope you're out there getting some of this. You're on my heart, you're on my mind. And I'm praying for you because we're heading into another disciple making semester. And I do hope you'll be a part of it. I love you. I love what God has done in your life. And I want you to replicate that in other people. That's how we make disciples. It's a great, great privilege. It's a high, high calling. And we have some resonance points in that, don't we? I love the last couple of weeks when we got together with the disciple makers and talked turkey and found the resonance points and learned some things from one another and stirred one another's hearts. Well, here we go. Let's do this thing, shall we? And in that direction, got a couple things on my heart. I think this will be cool. So number one is that this coming Saturday, September 7th, is our Disciple Making Conference, first of its kind at New Horizon. It's 8.30 a.m. to 11.30 a.m. We'll start with a bag. We'll have a break, that kind of thing. But I've invited you guys and people in groups and people wanting to get in groups and people that don't know anything about groups. It's church-wide because I want to wrap our hearts around disciple making. And I wanna offer the framework that I've been developing, the stuff, much of it that I presented in India and to other pastors in the area and such. And I want us on the same place. I don't know how to bring that stuff to us other than just to keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. And so to get together and think it through, I think it'll be motivating. I think it'll be fun. We've got some exercises we get to do together. And uh, I think we'll get, uh, we'll be, we'll sense the call of God to be a disciple making church. And so I hope you'll be there. I hope you'll light up a text thread and invite some of your friends and people from your present group, past groups, family members, etc. and be with us Saturday 8.30 to 11.30. Then here's the other thing I want to give you. It's just kind of a new deal in my soul and I shared it with the, sta- with the staff and they said, man, you, let's do this thing. So when we head into the fall, we're going to light up our Wednesday nights. We're gonna, we haven't done that in a long time. So we're going to have K through high school opportunities with adult opportunities as well. The opportunity, I'm sorry, the idea here is to give opportunity for entire families to be a part of disciple making. So yay for our directors of the age level ministries. They're working on that right now so we can make this thing happen. Here's the idea. I don't know what you might do with your group, but you know that in the fall we're going to do Holy Helper message series. It's about the Holy Spirit. In particular, how the Holy Spirit is part of us growing as disciples. It's everyday stuff, I think very practical, and I want us to get a hold of the, the Holy Spirit as we grow in, as, as disciples. We can't do it without Him. And so let's really dig into that. Let's talk about that in our groups, and let's get better acquainted with the chief disciple maker who is the Holy Spirit. How's that sound? Well, here's the big idea. Maybe you'll do that at your house. Maybe you'll do that at Harvest Market. Maybe you'll do something else, whatever it might be. But if you're undecided, if you're on the bubble, if you're wondering how you might be a part of this, how about cluster groups? Cluster groups. Now, what in the world does that mean? Well, here's the brainchild, okay? Wednesday, 6.30 to 8. Cluster groups, that's all the participants in these cluster groups will meet in the worship area and we'll be there together and we'll meet as an audience. And just for a few minutes, I'll kind of introduce our topic for the night and we can pass out the, you know, the questionnaire that came with the Sunday morning presentation. And by the way, if you miss a Sunday, we're gonna have a click on the front page of the website where you get the audio only of the message so you can catch up, listen to it at two times speed, boom. You got it going on. So we're meeting together as an audience in the worship area, all the different participants of several cluster groups. And then after a few minutes, we're gonna break up into the cluster groups. And what that looks like is some circles of chairs, various places in the worship area, and your group would meet there. And you would be the disciple maker in that group. And for the next hour, you would lead your group in conversation around the Holy Spirit with that question series. How cool is that? But the deal is then when that's over, let's reconvene as an audience for some Q&A. Because this Holy Spirit stuff, it's kind of mysterious, isn't it? And I'm no expert. I don't know that anybody is an expert on the Holy Spirit, but some Q&A and talking some stuff up so that we can kind of have a wrap in that way after what we've studied that night, what we've talked about and fellowshiped with that night. That would be a cluster group. And so uh, maybe that would kind of settle the score for you. You could be part of a cluster group. You could lead a cluster group on Wednesday nights. Now, to that end, uh, connected with this video, and it will be in a, in a link in the description, is uh, a form for you to go to online where you can describe 
what's on your heart and what you think you'll be doing with your group and when you'll meet and where you'll meet and what you'll be doing so we can represent you well, promote you. Is it an open group? Is it a closed group? Where do you meet and is it in the building? Do we, we need to make arrangements for you to be there? Do you need AV, et cetera? Do you want to be a cluster group? Are you an alpha group? All those kinds of things are in the questionnaire and that will kind of settle the score on who we are and what we're going to be doing so we can help offer. And as I said in our meetings, I really want to, uh, want to invite people, if they don't know how to get in a group, to come to me so that I might place them in a group. And if you're open to having a person placed in your group, I want you to indicate that on that form as well. Online, you'll click send and I'll get that and we'll be in business. So I leave those things with you today and I hope I've encouraged your heart to be a part of disciple making. I can't wait. I'm going to be uh, in those cluster groups and such. And in fact, last night, one of the groups I was in said, we're going to be a part of cluster groups. That sounds like a great idea. So I'll leave it with that, friends. Look forward to seeing you uh, at the conference and then on Friend Day, and we'll talk more about our groups, okay? Thank you for what you do. I pray God's blessings upon you. May our ministry unto Jesus be fruitful and effective. Amen. Love you all. Bye-bye.